Hello, I'm Ken with Orion Telescopes and Binoculars, and this is the Orion uh, uh, Telescope Observer's Guide. It's a new book that we've put together that features 60 uh, objects to get started. So when I'm talking with uh, uh, folks that want to buy a telescope, uh, or they've just gotten their first telescope and they don't know what to look for, they ask me, what's the next step? What do I need to start finding things in the sky? Um, especially if you don't get one of the computerized telescopes uh, and, and you're hunting things down yourself. Uh, well, a book like this is a great resource to kind of get an idea of what to look for next. And even if you do have those computerized telescopes, there's lots of details on each object in here. So uh, the, the computer system will help you find the object, but it doesn't tell you much about it. It doesn't tell you how big it is, how bright it is, uh, what might work best to see it in terms of which eyepieces you might need. So there's lots of hints and tips on each object. And just for an example, I'll, I'll turn to uh, one of my favorite objects, this is the Ring Nebula. It gives you the naked eye view, your finder scope view, and then a view with a specific eyepiece. And uh, it'll, again, tell you exactly what might work best. So it's got details about the object. This is the Ring Nebula, M57, the constellation it lies in, the coordinates. Uh, and then what you should expect to see at low power, at 27 power, it does something here. I can't really read it upside down. At higher power, uh, this is an object that actually works best at a little bit higher magnification. Um, and then it continues on at 161 power and details what the differences are. So a great way to start getting into the hobby, uh, learning about the objects, and then how to best use your telescope and the accessories that you might have gotten to, to best view the objects that are up in the night sky. So the Telescope Observer's Guide is a great book by itself. It makes a great add-on to the family's telescope, but it's also found in a lot of the kits that we sell. We include it as part of the package. All right, well, there you have it. This is the Orion uh, Telescope Observer's Guide. Thank you very much. Clear skies.